Here with Coral Keane, who's our first time blogger, who's just completed her dress test. Are you happy with how it went? Yeah, I am. There's always room for improvement. Um, but he's only 10 and he's not hugely established at this level yet. Um, and I'm really happy with him. I didn't, I didn't do too much wrong in there. Just went a little bit frozen on me. I think the atmosphere, there's a lot to look at. And he kept his head, but he just sort of froze a little bit in his body. Um, but I'm really happy with him. And did it feel a big step up to that kind of four-star with both the atmosphere and the difficulty of the test? Um, yeah, there, yeah, there is a little bit more in a four-star test to a three-star test, for sure. Um, but uh, he was, he, I've done all my preparation and I'd like to think that he was uh, ready for it. Um, but there is a huge atmosphere here, but there would be at Blenheim and places like that as well. Um, so he has, he has been working in places with a big atmosphere, but I'm really pleased with him. And now it's getting closer, how are you feeling about his country tomorrow? Um, well, my focus today is mainly been on this. Um, I'll go out and walk the course this afternoon, uh, have another look and then walk it again on my own in the morning. And really really sort of focus and work out exactly what I'm doing. Um, but I'm looking forward to it in May. Have you decided any yeah. route options, any yeah. long routes you're planning to take? Yeah, um, the first water I'm going to see how it rides. I think it's one of those fences that need to ride really, really well. Um, the distance and the turn up to the step to the other corner. Or it will not ride well, in which case I might go long with him just to get him home safe. Um, and I definitely will take a long route. Um, uh, the ditch, uh, ditch rail to the corner, brush corner. Um, I'll go long there just in case he has a funny look at the fence or something.